What's up, everyone? It's me, Ashton Kamian. Let's talk about the conflicts in Ukraine. Hey, guys, it's me, Ashton, here. Um, this is really crazy. We have not seen this in a really long time. A invasion in Europe like that in Ukraine. Last time that happened in World War II from the German army. And it is really crazy, guys. Um, um, I will tell you guys about the story of the conflicts. I, I don't know. I, um... I know, I know why Russia invading, because I, Ukraine is, used to be part of, of Russia, long, long time ago, and yeah, I know there's going to be a lot of people have different opinions, or different, hear about different stories, and yeah, and it is really crazy, and let me know down in the comment section if you guys are by Ukraine, or by Russia, let me know please, and yeah, to me, I'm pretty much by Ukraine. I respect both sides, the Russians and Ukrainian. And yeah, um, I will tell you guys first what is going on in the in the beginning of the, um, the conflicts. Um, um, earlier, I think it was earlier this month, Russia decided to decided to force their troops um, doing their training exercise and to they're getting ready for invasion. And we, our president, U.S. president, and few other government. We're telling telling the Ukraine president, um, get ready. I think this is gonna be the invasion, and and Ukraine president said, oh, this is not gonna be an invasion. Just Russia's just gonna do their training outsize, and and we were been telling them, I think you should prayer, and and we were trying to get them ammunition and supplies, and and oh yeah, and Ukrainian president said, oh, why are you doing that? The pretty much. <laughs> And we decided to stay neutral, and we decided to get all American citizens in, um, 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 oh yeah, in the embassy out of there, because I, we were thinking, we were expecting an invasion, and we did the right thing, getting all these, these Americans out of there, and Ukraine president said, said, why are you making your people panic? To not bring them panic, <laughs> and they, they decided to leave, and yeah. And I actually think we did a good job um, back with the Americans. Unfortunately, some Americans decide to stay because they have husbands and wives or Ukrainian. They marry. and Or some were just doing, maybe teaching schools how to speak English. And unfortunately, the whole conflict started. And and in, in overnight, there was attack. And a lot of Ukrainian were pair the when they were not a Expecting a huge invasion, and and Ukraine have lost some grounds, a lot of grounds, and I think next day Ukrainians were building up bridge, trying to slow down the Russian advance, and and they were holding out their line. A lot of civilians tried to step up and speak up the Russians. They were saying, "You not opposed to attack our country," and. And what else? Oh yeah, and there was some people who were trying to stop armored vehicles or tanks, and it is really crazy. Sorry, I'm just seeing my hand bleeding a little bit. <laughs> anyway, that way I'm just making sure um, they're not coming, not coming down. <laughs> um, um, oh yeah, and in the invasion, um, um, Russians were 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 using their fighter jet. There's one fighter jet Ukraine to have was the Ace was the. Ghost of you, Ghost of Keys. I, I may say the city wrong. Don't get mad at me, guys. And that brave pilot got a couple kills. It is amazing. And yeah, I think he landed somewhere separate. I think got taken down, and he was amazing. And well, the well the Russians were trying to invade the Keys, the capital, and because they want to capture the president. President said we're gonna put up a good fight, and we're gonna keep our cities safe. I mean, our ground, and yeah, luckily Ukraine have retake some ground. Two, they have takes a lot of prisoners, a lot of Russian prisoners, and three, they have captured some Russian armored vehicles too, which I hold out longer, and yeah, and it is really crazy invasion. And there's one one island the Ukrainian <laughs> spoke up to the Russian ships. I'm not trying to laugh. They they were did a good job staying there. They told the Russians a bad word, and and the Russians decided to open fire. It was really crazy, guys. And yeah, um, um, what else? Oh yeah, and a lot of people are in their bunkers or are, are being safe or in in subway tunnels, 
And I heard there's going to be a huge invasion force in in the capital soon, they, they think. And yeah. And sure is crazy. And I've watched other YouTubers, they're predicting what could happen. And yeah. And don't worry guys, on this video, on these videos, I'm going to showcase my prediction of the crazy battles on my Toy Army Men. Maybe some Lego Star Wars guys. Just recreate the soldiers and civilians and Russians. And yeah. Showing what... Um, what will could happen and yeah um and by the way there's a there's a one city there's one city called Genoa a lot of you guys may have heard or some of you guys not is a horrible nuclear disaster happened a lot of people die and it was really sad and Russian took over it it was really crazy and yeah um all right guys me Ashen. Um, I hope you guys like this video, and by the way, hit that like button, two, hit that subscribe button, or three, hit that bell button when we make a new video, and, and don't forget, um, I have a P.O. Box down in the description, you guys are more welcome to send me an awesome fan letter, you're more welcome to send me all about this conflicts too, and yeah, and to me, I'm hoping for the peace sign, I mean, peace treaty soon, and, and, oh yeah, one more thing, the president of Ukraine said, Said he's hoping for a peace treaty. One person asked the Russian to make peace. And unfortunately, he said that if the peace treaty don't work out, he will st keep on fighting. And yeah, and if any Ukrainian people watching this, please be safe out there and serve your country. And two, get your loved ones get out there safely. And yeah, and if any Russian viewer watching this, you're more welcome to join and chat with me. And yeah. And you too, Ukrainian people, and or any people around the world, you're more welcome to chat with me too. End wars, no, no violent peace. All right, guys, me Ashina, go out and peace out.